Hello. Hi, how are you guys doing? Good. Are you expecting us? I think so. Are you from uh, Glasscraft? Glasscraft, Preston, Hannah. Yeah, yeah. Cool. I've had a R6 before. I'm so happy right now. <laughs> Maybe catch a nap before my plane. Oh, okay. Your plane's later today? No, it's tomorrow. Tomorrow. But there's just a lot to do. Yeah, there is, yeah. <laughs> so, you know, I'll sleep when I get back to San Diego. I'm not too worried about it. You guys gonna put me to work? You wanna go to work? Here, take over here for me. a Bunsen burner heavily and that is a whole different animal. It's something that I don't see a lot of other flame workers doing and it's really helped me uh, gain the confidence that I needed to gain to forge through a lot of these new techniques without really knowing what I'm doing. How to keep your piece hot and in turn maintain a high level of confidence as you're working through your piece so that it just ends up in the kiln finished instead of in pieces on your bench or on the floor. The Bunsen burner, that changed my game. You know, and, and Preston was the first one that I really saw using it. And then I saw him work in a shop and those guys, you know, started using it and stuff. And it allows you to keep your piece out of the kiln for about half an hour or, you know, as long as you want. Anytime. Okay, I'm ready. Hi, I'm Preston Hanna. Here today at uh, Cornerstone Studios, courtesy of Glasscraft, to uh, show you guys how to utilize Bunsen burner and basically build an on-off. And this isn't just, you know, a, a, a simple technique, even though I'm making a simple piece. For some of you more advanced blowers, hopefully you're seeing the benefit of maybe being able to keep your piece warm while putting on all kinds of heady attachments or something like that. I mean, that's certainly how I use it back in my studio more often than not. It isn't just for the heady glass blower. This, this is a, a technique that's really good for pretty much anything. So, let's begin. There we go. I'm gonna use my Bunsen burner right here. That's one of my ultimate ninja tricks. Nobody really gets to see them very often, so I'm happy to share them with you. 